Welcome to Kari's Conscious Living. Please subscribe. The button's down there. Can you see it? On your right. Right there. Yes, that's it. Thank you so much. Welcome to the family. Are you ready to meditate with Kari? To lay down and relax and get comfortable and snug as a bug in a rug? You can close your eyes and listen to the story if you want to, or you can leave them open. It's completely up to you. But try and be still and calm and let your body start to relax. Danny, Ben, Linda and Rose were in a special squad. They were in the broccoli squad. Sounds pretty lame, I know. Not so cool. Broccoli squad? What's that? Who likes broccoli? Not many people. Well, actually, I like broccoli. And I know a few people that like broccoli. I know especially that Danny, Ben, Linda and Rose love broccoli. They love broccoli because it has special, magical, superhero powers. It was sports day. And all of those kids, Danny and Rose and Linda and Ben, were known for how fast they could run. They always seemed to run the fastest and win all the races. They were known in school. It was like no one else almost tried because they knew that those guys would win. They didn't know that the broccoli squad was part of why they run. They didn't know that the broccoli squad was why they win. Let me tell you all about it. Ben started the Broccoli Squad. Under his own discoveries, he found that when he ate broccoli, he could run super fast. Why? Well, what happens when you eat broccoli? For some people, it's totally fine. But for other people, they can have problems with tummy ache. Problems like it makes you a little bit gassy. It might give you tummy ache. It might make your tummy swell up because it's so full of gas. And then eventually what happens, which can be very, very embarrassing, is that broccoli could actually make you toot. Yes, toot. Now, all of us, or most of us, would get super embarrassed about tooting because they'd eaten broccoli. Nobody really wants to toot in front of their friends. But Danny discovered that all of that gas became like an engine inside of him. And he used the force of his toots. Yes, it sounds ridiculous, but it worked. He used the force of his toots to run super duper fast, like superhero fast. When he told his friend Danny about this, Danny was like, no way, no, dude, no. And Ben was like, yes, it works. Trust me, try it. Danny tried it. They call them broccoli brunches. They make sure that their parents all pack them broccoli on days where they have to do certain sports and running especially. So Danny had a broccoli brunch and he happened to be one of those people that got very, very gassy. And obviously, if he didn't let the gas out, he may explode. Timing, precision were needed and if he timed it just right and he released his gas, it would give him super duper momentum. And this made him ultra speedy. Just like Ben. Because Ben and Danny were best friends with Linda and Rose, they told Linda and Rose about the broccoli brunch and how it makes you have these super fast powers. The girls were giggling, very embarrassed about the fact that they would have to toot to run quicker. No way! 
they said. But, in retrospect, it could be super fun, said Rose. I'll give it a try. The following week, on sports day, her mum made her broccoli for brunch. Her mum thought it was a very strange request, as she's not really into broccoli. But Rose was willing to try. She ate her brunch. And just like Ben and Danny, she had the same kind of reaction. It gave her tummy ache and it made her gassy. And she had two powers. Because of the success of Rose's experience, Linda had to have a try. So yes, she did the same thing. She had a broccoli brunch. She got gassy. And she also had two powers. Linda and Rose had a friend called Sally. Sally tried it. Nothing happened. She doesn't get tummy ache with broccoli. Actually, broccoli suits her very well. It's one of her favourite foods. She never gets gassy with it. Which, like I said, can happen with some people. But unfortunately for Sally, she wasn't going to get any toot powers. So, the broccoli squad was just four people. Four super fast people. Now, one night, they all got together and had a broccoli dinner. They had plans. They figured if broccoli could make them run at super, super fast speeds, what if, what if it could make them fly? They all discussed that they would need more broccoli than normal because they would need some kind of momentum to get them up off the ground. That would have to be some very, very forceful gas, right? They ate lots and lots and lots of broccoli. Their skin was wonderful. Their hair was super shiny. They were very healthy with all these green vegetables. That was a side effect that was very pleasant. On the night that they tried to fly, they ate the biggest broccoli dinner ever. They all decided that they were going to go outside and climb the local hill. It wasn't very far. It was just around the corner from Ben's house. It was a hill that they thought would be kind of tall enough that they could have a run and jump. And if it didn't work, it would be okay. They'd probably just kind of roll down the hill. The hill was a grassy hill and it was nice and soft and it wouldn't hurt them. They tried it. Danny went first. His tummy was ready. He had a very, very bad tummy ache. Very swollen and puffy. He timed it just right. He started to run and run and run. And then all of a sudden, he tooted and he flew. His feet came up off the ground and he stayed off the ground. He shouted down to everyone. It works! You just have to keep tooting! Toot and toot and toot! And when you've run out of toots, you start to come down! Watch! Danny was going higher and higher and higher, and then all of a sudden, he timed it, so he was coming down. But quite slowly, not dangerously, down and down and down, until he landed on the ground, safely. All the others couldn't wait to try. And it worked with each one of them. Who would have thought that broccoli brunches and broccoli dinners could give you magical tooting powers? They decided that they wouldn't tell anyone about the broccoli squad. It had to be a secret. A secret that no one would know about. Because tooting's quite embarrassing. You don't want to tell everyone in the world that you're tooting a lot, do you? You want to keep that to yourself. But in the broccoli squad, it was completely safe to toot as much as you needed, to run as fast as you needed, to fly if you needed, to jump as high as you could if you needed, all from the force of magical toots. How cool is that?